Hi everybody, my name is Mariam Akbar, back with O1 Beauty, to show you how to use our volume iron. So we're gonna teach you guys how to turn this baby on and manage your heat preferences. So press down on the power button to turn on. You're gonna select your heat preference that you want by using the up or down. So we're gonna set it to 190. You'll see the numbers go up. And there we go. Why this is amazing is because you lock the temperature in, so when you're actually working on it, you don't accidentally press the button and change the temperature. I used to do that all the time. So to change your temperature, all you gotta do is double tap, and then you'll be able to manage it. Perfect. So to turn off, double tap and hold. So we're gonna section the top hair, flip it over to the other side, all right, so we're gonna get the first section. So the closer that you get to the scalp, the more lift that you get. If you guys notice, we're not crimping too close to the face. You wanna leave a little bit of room and then crimp behind that. It just frames the face so much nicer. Stamp it for about three to four seconds. It works really quickly. I like to stamp just under it. Flip and we'll work on our next section. Now let's say it feels a little bit hot and we want to change the temperature. Again, double tap, it unlocks it. We can go ahead and navigate the temperature as we wish. And we're going to flip, cover that, they'll never know. Before and after. So why don't we do the other side so that it matches and then you can actually get a feel of how easy it is to use this product. Wow, this is amazing. What a difference. I know, and it's so easy. I also love the 360 cord, because as you guys are seeing, as I'm moving around and doing different sections, it moves along with me. It makes it so much easier. I love any product that's so easy to use and it delivers on quality and all the things that it says it does. Very happy with this and very happy with the end result. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hope you learned a couple of things, and so we'll see you next time.